Temple University is less than a month away from students returning to campus to attend classes, but the university was forced to reduce classroom capacity for more than 15,600 seats to just 3,300 to comply with physical distancing guidelines. And Temple won't be reducing tuition for fall classes to account for the change in learning style. Instead, Temple introduced a tuition freeze. Students we spoke to say tuition should be reduced because the quality of their education will suffer. I feel like it's a little unfair that we're paying the same price, even if it's not more. I feel as if tuition and fees pay for the in-person, on-campus experience. They're not paying for an online experience. Temple's chief financial officer and treasurer, Ken Kaiser, said in a statement, even when many classes are online, the university still needs to account for the same fixed costs that come with being a campus-based institution, such as building security, utilities and maintenance, as well as paying staff who are either on campus we're working remotely. Temple has spent money to retrofit the campus to create more socially distanced classrooms in several buildings, including the Charles Library and the Paley Building. The conversion of the Paley Building alone is costing the university $3.4 million. I'm Matt Silverman reporting for Temple Update.